Infinity Ward added a new Halloween M4 here into Modern Warfare 2. Now, you get this by pre-ordering the Vault Edition of Modern Warfare 3. It's technically a $100 variant that you get for free because it really wasn't stated you would get this, but I ain't gonna lie, it looks pretty cool. Let me know in the comment section what you guys think. I was able to destroy lobbies with this. I created my own class set that I think you guys should check out. So if you guys enjoy, drop a like on the vid, subscribe to the channel, hit those notifications, and uh, let's run it up. All right, let's take a look at the new Halloween, Halloween M4. It's technically called the Soul Harvester, but it's the Halloween M4. Now for the first attach, we are gonna rock that X10 grip to increase that sprint to fire speed and aim down sight speed. A good attachment on the M4, we can get our first shot and hopefully get that kill. But a model for two, it's gonna happen. Now, for the tuning, we are gonna be increasing that sprint to fire speed some more to negative 0.44 and more aim down sight speed to negative 0.71, a fantastic attachment and tune combination. Now we are gonna go ahead and rock a stock and the Tempest P80 Strike stock is amazing on this weapon increasing sprint speed aim walking speed cross movement speed as a nice bonus and additional aim down side speed so we can move around the map rotate efficiently and win those gunfights now for the tuning we are going to be bumping up more aim walking speed here at negative 1.01 and more aim down side speed at negative 2.19 now we are not going to rock an optic the iron sights are perfectly fine for this build and we also be skipping over the laser these are not going to be helping us out either now we are going to rock the high tower 20 inch barrel which is hands down the best barrel to rock on the m4 if you're looking for a medium to long range monster we're gonna have that increased recoil control damage range bullet velocity and increased hip fire accuracy as a very nice bonus as well now for the tuning we are going to be increasing more aim down sight speed at negative 0.39 and aim walking speed at negative 0.32 we are going to rock this weapon loud and proud and that ftac castle comp is going to get the job done removing horizontal and vertical recoil giving us a very easy to use assault rifle at longer ranges now for the tuning we are going to be bumping up more recoil control at plus 0.28 and more aim down sight speed at negative 0.54 here and then finally we are going to rock the commando foregrip to smooth out that recoil pattern giving us a very easy to use weapon we can go full auto across the map without having to worry about a thing now for the tuning we are going to be increasing more aim walking speed here at negative 0.31 and more aim down sight speed at negative 0.15 once you go ahead and jump into the firing range, you're going to see this weapon looks pretty cool. The best part about it is we still can maintain the aesthetic of the Halloween M4. We're going to have a quick ADS, very low recoil, and we're going to have a pretty cool dismemberment effect. So definitely go ahead and give this weapon a try. Now for the secondary, we are going to go ahead and rock with the good old F-Tac Siege. We have the SIR-160 rear grip, the 72 round drum, the NST-81 barrel, the FGX DL-70 laser, and the Siege wire stock. Tuning is not necessary for this build. Now we are going to rock stun grenades, proximity mines, and for the perks, double time scavenger, resupply, quick fix, and for the field upgrades, we have pro enabled with munitions box and dead silence. Overall, a very nasty class set. You can't go wrong with. I was able to destroy lobby. I think you guys can do the same. So if you guys enjoy, drop a like on the vid, subscribe to the channel, turn those post notifications. Let me know down in the comment section if you guys prefer tuning or nerf tuning. I'm really curious. Ran into a friendly neighborhood corner camper. Changing mag. Enemy personnel at the hard point. I need to find a sniper. I know kids are sniping in here. I know kids are sniping in this lobby. I need to find one. Does he have a sniper rifle? Please tell me he does. I hear people behind me. Step 
That was my sniper I wanted to pick up, but that shit is too far away. Go, baby. Which way I want to go. Enemy personnel at the hard point. You have to miss Push this way. Our mortar strike is inbound. Come on, man. Which way are they going to come from? Push up. Where are these guys at? Do they got a full team? They do. Enemy down. We've got him on the run. Keep it up. Got him. Got that over there. I, I, I literally can't believe I got RPG'd off my street. Like, seriously. Thinking about it right now, I don't think I ever died to an RPG in MW3. And I know those were in the game too, or I should say in the beta, but I don't think I ever died to like an RPG or the Strella. I don't think I actually ever died to that shit. Loading. He ran away, smart man. I'm doing the same thing. Put that right there. Get over here. That's a decoy. <laughs> Move it out. We don't have time to get another one, but at the same time, I'm still gonna give these guys a bad time. You can at least try to get another set of streaks, that'd be cool. I, I, I bet you one of those kids is on RPG. Oh, 
Overwatch. Oh, mercy. Damn, we're actually frying right now. Again. We got, a, we got another advance. I mean, GG, 58. Go, baby. Enemy UAV active. Target area updated. Move to the hard point. Oh, wait, there's a kid back here? The heck? That kid must have been camping incredibly hard because I. Hold on. Put that right there. Pop the dead silent so we can go ahead and rotate out. Pop another gun. UAV is bingo fuel. RTB is enemy personnel at the hard point. Rotate over here. We can drop that right there just in case. Hell yeah. Enemy UAV overhead. Kilo ready for tasking. Locating the next hard point. Get ready. Vandal 3-1 is on station. Weapons hot. I got shot through a wall. The hell I get shot through a wall? Oh, hang it up. Oh, baby. Up that there, Watch UAV. Copy, UAV is on. Other Overwatch. Did you drop that attack with the? This is attack fifty six. You figure out where you guys are gonna come from, man. I feel like some guys are gonna come middle map, but I kind of want to be a little bit more aggressive. Setting mine. I could go there. Advanced. Yeah, this guy has a pretty interesting tack class on. Yeah, this fella has a pretty interesting TAC-56 class I picked up. I ain't gonna lie. This is something I definitely have not used before. Is he gonna peek this shit? Yeah, he is. This is a dead. That, 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 They gotta come, like... Wow. <laughs> what do you have? A Vel? I just felt like I died in one bullet. There, there it goes right there. That definitely... Wow, dude. Like, I literally felt like I died in the shot right there. Okay. 
<laughs> okay, cool, cool, cool. Jesus, this game is kind of weird now. I'm not gonna lie. I literally felt like I died in a bullet. There's a guy behind me. God. Oh my god. Teammate, you need to relax, big man. Overwatch. There's a kid in the corner. Alright, nice. Teammate took him out. There's like 30 kids coming this direction. Teammate. I want to say there's a kid up here. Okay, there's not. Confirming next half point. Stand by. Enemy down. Changing back. Sniper is down. Half point relocated. We have this one in the bag though. We should have had a nuke, no cap, but it is what it is. We got like two bullets. Pretty sure that's the guy that killed me off my streak, I think. That Vel, dude. Be advised, UAV is exiting the AO. That's 73, not bad. 